Greenwood House is a former stately home in Hampstead. The house was originally constructed in the 17th century and served as a residence for the Earls of Mansfield during the 18th and 19th centuries. The house was bought in 1925 by Edward Guinness, first Earl of Ivy, and donated to the nation in 1927. He was the head of the family's balloon business, making him the richest man in Ireland. Kenwood House contains a significant number of historic paintings and other works of art. Here, you will be astonished by the delicacy and elegance of these masterpieces. Here exhibits self-portraits with two circles by Rembrandt, one of the most celebrated artists in history. This painting was one of his last. As Rembrandt said, "Life etches itself onto our faces as we grow older, showing our violence, excesses, or kindnesses." The Adam Library, designed by Robert Adam, is considered one of the finest English 18th-century interiors anywhere. The paintings in this room have an interesting story. On the battlefield of Victoria in Spain in 1813, the Duke of Wellington captured the carriage of Joseph Bonaparte. In this carriage. Wellington soldiers discovered more than 200 paintings. They had been seized from the Spanish royal collection by Bonaparte, who, in 1808, had been made King of Spain by his brother Napoleon. Wellington made three attempts to return the paintings to the Spanish king, Ferdinand IV, who were refused. Competition in 18th-century British portraiture was fierce. The two paintings, both on the left and on the right, set the stage for the famous rivalry between Sir Joshua Reynolds and Thomas Gainsborough. This painting draws my attention as it looks so real that, as if there is a light in the painting itself. Okay, after a tour in the house, it is time to have a coffee and chill out. Who can ask for more for an afternoon in a garden like this? <laughs>